grape growers are needed in Virginia. The wine industry is booming across the Commonwealth, but there aren't enough grapes to support the continued growth. 10 News reporter Coulter Anstat explains. This week, about a dozen people showed up to the Institute for Advanced Learning and Research to learn about growing grapes. Brian Bell was one of them. I've always been a home brewer and um, uh, a home uh, winemaker. Getting people interested in growing grapes is the first step for Virginia Tech viticulturalist Tony Wolf and others like him trying to help Virginia's wine industry flourish. We don't have a lot of vineyards down in this area. There is land that is suitable for grape growing. So we'd like to uh, make sure that people are aware of the opportunities in the grape wine industry. Wolf was one of the speakers at the workshop at the Institute this week. According to his presentation, 19 new wineries have opened up in Virginia in the last three years. The industry could do with about 30% more grapes than what is currently being grown. That's because the state requires wineries to get at least 75% of their grapes from within the state. While Bell is interested in growing grapes for his personal use, he says he's also willing to try to help out the wine industry. I think it would be fun. I like uh, working with my hands. I like uh, farming activities. I grew up on a farm. A cost share program that provides up to $3,000 per acre for new growers is available. To learn more about it, visit WSLS.com. In Danville, Coulter Anstat, 10 News, working for you.